What's up guys, it's Radiant here and welcome back to another video. Today, we are going to be showing you my new dorm room and what they added in the newest update in Rec Room. So, I changed my dorm to something a little bit more cute. It has a lot more pink, um, which I think is very adorable um, because I love pink, but blue is my favorite color. Of course, that's why I have a blue strip in my hair with this outfit. But, we're going to go ahead and show you my dorm room, the weekly should change very, very soon. Turn my notifications off. The weekly should change in 44 minutes, so I'll be making another video on the weekly rotation. Over here, you can see a cute little photo I took. Me at the computer. I added seats to every chair that wasn't there um, originally. There's a cute TV here with hearts on the top. Let me sit down. Upstairs, you have a cute little chill area here. You can sit on the right or the left. You got flowers here. Over here it says, be lovely because you are lovely, which is very, very cool. Here's the toilet. Over here it says, nya, with a cute little kitty. Over here is like a little desk area with a cute little heart. These are six of my favorite community rooms. Mm -hmm. Nico Cafe, I showcased that one to you. The Stanley Parable, I might showcase that to you soon, maybe. Do You Copy, that was like one of my first showcases. Murder V3. Cards Against Humanity, or Cards Against the End of Humanity. And Boom It, which is pretty cool. You pass around a bomb, and that... And answer questions is very, very cool. I might showcase these very, very soon. Who knows? There is the LGBTQ flag up here. Gotta re represent. You can lay in the bed. Very cool. Outside, you have a castle and a rainbow over there. And the stars in the sky are moving, which is pretty cool. I added buttons downstairs on like almost all the Rec Room originals, and the LGBTQ plus room. Pretty cool. You can equip these headphones. Pretty adorable. You got chocolate here. Yum, yum. You got a phone here. And the weekly challenge is over here, guys. But anyway, let's go ahead and get into, um the update portion of this video. Rec Room released an update for June 14th, 2022, which was yesterday when I'm recording this. Um, and they added a clothing customizer for only RR Plus members can access. Um, it is in your backpack. It is called Clothing Customizer. You press Use, and it spawns right in front of you. You can see your character, your avatar on the right, you can see the front of the shirt and the back of the shirt. You have loads of markers to draw with. You have an eraser. You can change the shirt color to any wonderful, colorful option. You can also spawn in, let's say, let's say I want a paintbrush. Boom. And I can actually draw on it. Which you can see it actually works. <laughs> but since it's the same color as the shirt, it kind of blends in. So let me go ahead and put orange. There we go. You can see it now. You can also delete your shirt design by pressing the trash can logo. This will clear your current design. You can always access your last saved design by reloading the whiteboard. Clear. Now, let me go ahead and put just random stuff here. I, I'm i moving all over the place. <laughs> Alright. Let me just put some scribbles. And some scribbles on the back. 
Now, if you guys want to save your design so you can come back to it later, you can press save and it will say design saved. So if you delete the clothing customizer and you come back to it later, your design will still be there. Now I'm going to be showing you a shirt that I made, which I think is just very basic. Anyone can do it. Um, I didn't go all out or anything. So to find your custom shirts that you have created, go to the customize menu. Click the torso button. And click the custom tab. It has my name on it. And on the back, it says I'm Angel. Very cool. Um, another thing they added in the update was your photo roll in the camera. So when you take a picture, let me save it privately. You can save photo, and this will pop up. You can share your own photo. You can see who player is in the photo, and you can set it to public and private. You can print the photo, like so. I'm gonna put it here. It doesn't go there, that's okay. You can set it as your profile picture, which I'm not going to do, and you can delete it, like so. But anyway, guys, that's going to be the end of this video. Stay tuned today for the weekly rotation video. But anyway, drop a like on this video if you enjoyed it. Subscribe to my channel if you're new. This has been Radiant KO, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.